Hey, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another restoration with Fat Vic. Today we're going to be doing a custom on these Jordan cleats. As you can see, they're pretty jacked up, but we're going to go ahead and get them all fixed up. Morning, Kilo. It's 3 in the afternoon for crying out loud. All right, guys. So the first step is going to be to tape up uh, the shoe using my limited edition Vix Scotch tape. As you guys already know, I'm the tape god, so let's get started. Dude. This is the third time to this week. My bad, bro. Nah, dude. You My... told you a million times already. Don't come in here. Yo, but the, the warehouse is over there. But the fans on restoration with Fat Vic, bro. I'm giving them what they want. Dude, this is not about you. It's about me. <laughs> Hey, get your ass out of here. Can I take hey, Steve. my Steve? Can I take my shoe? Nah, with dude, me? get the hell out of here. Steve, get Johnny out of here. Don't come back. What's going on, YouTube? Sorry about that doofus in the beginning of the video. If you guys ever see him in the street, kick him in the nuts and say, this is from Vic. Whatever, let's get started with this video. Today we're going to be working on a pair of Chrome Low 6s. We're going to be customizing these into a Space Jam theme. We're going to be dyeing the soles blue, changing the mantle to a black and white, and giving it some blue accents on the uppers. Let's get started. All right, so we got the shoes taped up. Now we're gonna go ahead and remove the old paint and factory finish using acetone and cotton balls. The missiles are fully stripped, check them out. Now we're gonna go ahead and remove the tape just because it's been damaged from the acetone and cotton balls. So we're gonna go ahead and retape the shoe so we can get started with the paint job. Alright, so we have the shoes taped up, uppers and sole. Now we're gonna move on to painting the midsoles. The first color we're gonna lay down is this flat white, and we're gonna be using an angular brush to do that. All right, so after many, many coats of flat white, it's finally done. Now we're finally gonna move on to the black parts, which is the teeth and these two side parts and this little piece. We're gonna be using flat black paint and this small angular brush. All right, guys, that midsole paint job's complete. Check it out. What we're gonna do next is spray the whole midsole with the matte finish. Let it dry for about an hour. Come back and hit the black parts with the glossy finish. All right, so after letting the matte finish dry for about an hour, we're gonna go ahead and apply the glossy finish to the black areas. We're gonna be using Angelus High Gloss Acrylic Finisher and a paintbrush.
All right, so the paint job's complete. Matte finish laid down, glossy finish as well. All we gotta do now is move the tape and move on to the uppers. What we're gonna do next is touch up this jump man and this back tab and turn them blue. All right, so the mention on this custom is complete. These are looking really clean, simple. These kind of look like the Oreo 5s. Right now, there's a lot of different directions we could go with this custom, but we're gonna stick with the Space Jam theme. So now we're gonna move on to the blue paint. All right, so the blue's been laid down. The next thing we're gonna do is table up the rest of the shoes so we can spray them with the matte finish. All right, so after letting the finish dry for about an hour, we're gonna go ahead and remove the tape. We're gonna be using an X-Acto knife just in case some of the paint is stuck on the tape. All right, so the uppers are pretty much complete. All we gotta do now is dye the soles. We're gonna be using some Space Jam blue sole dye and a brush. There's no better feeling than thinking you're done, but you're really not. Where's Fat Vic when you need him? Completely forgot we got a back jump, man. So I'm gonna go ahead and touch that up with this little angular brush and some blue paint. All right, so we just finished up the jump man in the back. Now we're gonna go ahead and spray him with some Rejuvenator water and stain repellent to protect the whole custom. All right guys, that's gonna wrap it up on these custom low sixes. At first, I said it was gonna have a Space Jam theme, but as I was going with the custom, I realized it also has a Sport Blue 3 theme. But anyway, I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I did. I dyed the soles blue, gave it a flat white paint job with a glossy, with a glossy black, painted this back tab, as well as these two jump mats in the back and front, and gave it a blue lace lock. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned something. See you guys next Monday. Thank you guys for tuning in for another episode of Rush Racing Vic.